Are you active duty military right now? What the fuck is that? Did you serve your country and you are now a veteran? Then once a year, you may be entitled to a Veterans Day discount on November 11th, right after November 10th, which is... If any of this applies to you, then this is for you. In this video, I will be ranking every restaurant that offers a Veterans Day discount and putting them into a tier list, so you and the boys can effectively decide where you are dropping this November 11th. However, I will not be covering restaurants that offer Veterans Day deals if I haven't tried them myself, since I wouldn't be able to assign an accurate score and, uh, yeah. Let's do this. First up, Olive Garden. When you're there, your family. Complimentary entree, plus the... Soup, breadsticks, and the salad. S tier. Oh my god, just fuck me up with the Parmesan, Luigi. I hop. A small stack of pancakes. I mean, they're pancakes, so nothing all that special. D tier. I'd rank it higher if it was an omelet or French toast or something like that. Dunkin' Donuts. Free donut of your choice. I mean, I guess that's cool. C tier. Starbucks. A free tall 12 ounce brewed coffee. Hot or iced. Coffee is nice, but. It's just coffee. C tier. Outback Steakhouse. A free blooming onion with purchase of an entree. F that. Me and my boys can make a better blooming onion than you guys can. Plus, you're gonna make me pay on this sacred day? F tier. Chili's. Veterans receive any one of these complimentary meals. <laughs> I get the quesadilla. B tier. Applebee's. A free meal from their select menu items. Classic bacon cheeseburger, six ounce, top sirloin steak, chicken tender platter, double crunch shrimp, fiesta lime chicken, oriental chicken salad, or a three cheese chicken panini. That is a whole lot of options. S tier. Farmer Boys. Get a free cheeseburger at participating locations. Dine in only. Farmer Boys can be pricey, but, you know, they're pretty good. C tier. Krispy Kreme. Get a free donut and coffee. Honestly, you could probably skip Starbucks and Dunkin Donuts and just go straight to Krispy Kreme. You get the best of both worlds there. A tier. in and out Complimentary meal. in and out is an interesting place because the burger is good. The shake is okay. But the fries. The f***ing fries. C tier. Buffalo Wild Wings. 10 free boneless wings and fries. Dine in or walk in orders. I don't know if it's just me, but it feels like the quality of Buffalo Wild Wings has gone down, or maybe I'm just getting older. Who knows? S tier. The food still slaps. Fucking sue me. Perkins Restaurant and Bakery. Receive a free American trio meal. Pancakes with some bacon and eggs. B tier. That's how you do it, IHOP. <laughs> Texas Roadhouse. Receive a free meal voucher for a specific menu item from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Dine in or carry out at a later time. Voucher expires May 30th, 2025. Endless biscuits, a fat piece of meat with some hearty sides that will lead you into an early heart attack. Sign me right the f*** up. S tier. Little Caesars Pizza. Receive a free lunch combo in the afternoon. Pizza is hot and ready, but is it good? And plus, the offer is only available in the afternoon, so D tier. Firehouse subs, a free medium sub with purchase. F tier. What the fuck? Well, that's about it for now. I know there are a lot more places that offer Veterans Day deals, but I haven't tried them yet, so this is what we got for now. Plus, this video might suck in the algorithm, and I'm already posting this video a little later than I wanted to. But more importantly, I want to know, what do you think? Do you agree with my ranking? What should be added to the tier list? Let me know in the comments below. In the meantime, happy birthday, Marines. Happy Veterans Day. Reach out to the homies. And thank you for watching.